freshman year, we uh, won two games. And to go from that to this, it's awesome. And the past is gone. Then, 2017 happened. Griffin Soccer's 2017 so far has been a freaking fairy tale. Execution has never been better. The end. <laughs> <laughs> A program with just two winning seasons in its 12-year existence has stunningly thrust itself into the national spotlight. It's a different type of pressure now. It's, it's fun. We're playing as a team and a team that can win. But what's even more intriguing is the way they've been winning. All we need is somebody to lean on. So it was like, oh, we're just playing Griffin soccer. I go, Griffin soccer has never been known to score this many goals. A program that has traditionally struggled to score now leads the Division II nation in scoring. We never had a bench this deep. You just gotta know that you can put the ball in the back and then have that confidence to do it. We scored 27 goals and one conceded three, so we're defending the way we always have. And everybody's scoring goals and everybody's helping out and everybody's contributing. It helps when you own the nation's individual leading score. Junior Cassidy Minky has nine goals for the first six games. Seriously, I watch and I'm just like, it's so graceful. Like literally, it looks like so effortless and I'm just like, you keep, you keep going, you do your thing. I mean, it's a team effort. I mean, I'm not the only one out there. I know, but. I'm just trying to, my team are giving me opportunities. I'm just trying to execute those opportunities. This is a special team. Their next game is unquestionably their biggest game ever, period. The nation's top offense against the nation's top defense. Dream on, dream until the come the seven-time defending MIAA champion Jennies are also 6-0. They have outscored their opponents a combined 26-0. A team that, you know, we don't aspire to be, we want to be better than them, but give them credit. I mean, they're consistently at the top of this league, and we're going to see who we are Friday night. We believe that we can beat them. Actually, I know we can beat them. It's just going to come down to who puts that ball in the back of the net. Miracles happen every day, and they happen most often in fairy tales. But no matter what happens on Friday, it's only the next chapter, and there are still many more to come. Hey!